WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. We start our day with the mixed bag. The mix goes like this. You've got the Dow up 137 points. The Dow transports 39. New York Stock Exchange 75. The other U.S. indices that we trade are trading to the downside. The S&P down 16. NASDAQ up 208. Russell's down two points. Semi's down 110. We got the spot fix index that is trading out at 1757. I believe that is above the 50 day exponential moving average. We'll take a look at that momentarily. We got gold off three bucks, silver's down a penny, lights recruit up a buck and a quarter. Let's take a look at what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin upper left hand side. We've got the ES mini new profiles. We got the December contract price to trade above the top of its profile, which is 5468, likely targeting that descending trend line. May have had a bit higher out there, but we are running into resistance. However, and that resistance that we're running into, if we do get a close today above the 50-day expense moving average. That's printing at um, 1740. We're trading at 1763 right now in the spot fix. If we close above that, that's going to shift um, the markets back into, uh, well, it'll give the sellers the edge. We've got the NQ that is trading above the top of its profile and running into resistance. That's its descending trend line. We take a look at the U.S. dollar index. U.S. dollar index pretty much in a sideways consolidation formed a road momentum indicator bottom pattern a couple of weeks ago down at 100.08. If price were to close below that, we would likely see lower price. Goldilocks negated any topping signals it had last week, daily, weekly, monthly. Uh, so gold is likely to continue its rally forward. Silver doing the same. It's got a simple, e easy to identify A to B equals C dependent on the upside with an initial price projection of 31.80. If you take a look at light speed crude, light speed crude consolidating with inside its daily profile. That's between the range of 66.18 for support and 70.75 as resistance. Natural gas, now in the case of light speed crude and natural gas, we have flipped over to the November contract. So we take a look at the November contract for natural gas. You'll see a new profile forming today. Support at 220, resistance up at the uh, 234, to call 235, level in the center of that profile, 226. Uh, we take a look at the 30-year Treasury. A close today above 126.30 would go ahead and generate an A to B equals CD pattern to the upside. It would also um, negate a TD9 count top. So level to be watching there at day's end is going to be 126.30. We're trading 127 right now, so just one tick above that level. Steve Rhodes with TFNN. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Said Show. We drop to start your Monday. Have a magnificent one. Thanks for joining us, and we'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.